and it does a slash, so it's like all the way down. So uh, there's a lot of shouting in this video. So anyways. Hello and welcome to another Ken OE Reviews. Today I'm going back to the uh, older style of uh, reviewing. Unfortunately, the stop motion reviews take quite some time to develop. You know, you got you got all the photo uh, photographing and the uh, script and uh, and all the editing. So uh, unfortunately, I, as much as I love to, I can't make every review a stop motion one, or else it's gonna take like weeks before I could re uh, like two weeks before I could release one of it. So I hope you guys like the previous ones, and I hope you like. Yeah, I, I hope you guys don't mind this uh, old style review I will still there will still be one coming up soon so stay tuned for that yes I will be releasing a stop motion review soon enough but let's get to this guy so Kamen Rider Amazon Omega SH figure arts based on the web series on uh, Japanese Amazon it was released as a series and uh, go figure Amazon you know from Amazon company they released a more mature tone of the uh, the classic Kamen Rider Amazon series so, this series is called Kamen Rider Amazons, and first off in the SH Figure Arts line, we have the Kamen Rider Amazon Omega. So, I'm really excited, and uh, this is right out of the box. So, as you can see, there's a... So, without further ado, let's... let's I gotta say, this figure is beautiful. Look at that, my god! Oh, so shiny. The greens. Oh, I love it. I really love the look of this figure, and it comes with tons of accessory this is one of those figures that is really worth your purchase but let's look at the box first so the box it has open your amazons right inscripted on there and then you have the beautiful figure posing and then on the back it says look at that all oh, the weapons all oh, the poses it could do so yeah, basically the belt can come out as, as a javelin or a blade and then it isn't ha even has a slash uh effect so well, without further ado, let's have a closer look at the figure. Well, hello there, Mr. Amazons. Wow, this, I, I'm gonna put a picture right about here. Doesn't that look similar? Doesn't that, it does, it does to me. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. It's, I like how the paint application, SH Figure Arts, you've done it once again. Beautiful paint application. I like the metallic green, oh, oh beautiful, it works really well. All oh, the belt, especially the belt is sculpted proportionally, very nice. And all the blades is really sharp, so you know, for the kids owning this uh, toy, please be careful, these are actually sharp, you know. They don't care anymore, this is for a mature audience. You know, since the series is for mature audience, this toy is for mature audiences as well. Oh, no, anyway, so yeah, so everything is sculpted really well, uh, right up to the belt. So look at all the details sculpted in there, and the handles, and then on the side there, they even have that. Look at all those little, little, tiny little details. And they even painted it blue. They could have not even painted those two little things. It must be a paint, just putting a paintbrush. Like, <sighs> Any slight thing, it would have a botch there, but they did it. And it turned out amazing, turned out looking amazing. Look at that. So this is all... Oh, and all this glory, all this Amazonian glory. So, a beautiful figure. So, without further ado, let's have a look at his accessories. And there is a ton of accessories. So, they provided not one, not two, not even three, but four pairs of extra hands on top of the fisted ones. So, yeah, that's that's how that's how many hands there are. Eight hands for you to, to swap and everything. So, first off, is the javelin holding hand. So this hand is particularly just to hold the uh, the thinner uh, portion of this javelin and look at that javelin. It is that long and it's beautiful with a metallic dark gray and it's pointy as well. So please be careful and um, and wow, this, is, this looks really nice. And the second one is for, is the hand to hold the handle part of the weapon. So you can hold, that belt portion, you can take it off. So I'll demonstrate it to you shortly. So yeah, and then this is the knife part of it. So again, yeah, wow. Woo -hoo. And it looks, it looks beautiful. Look at that. It looks amazing. Another amazing, another amazing weapon accessory. And then it has two types of claws. So you have one claw that is just slightly, just all the way, all the way open handed ones. And then one that's, you know, with the fingers slightly curled up a little bit, you know, maybe just to pose with the javelin or something like that, just to hold or something. So basically, yeah, two types of open clawing handles, you know, just to scratch people, that kind of thing. So 
And as for the belt, you can actually take this portion out. So you can't really twist it, uh, I believe. So all you have to do is pull it out. So yeah, it's, the peg is long enough for you to hold it in. So hopefully it doesn't come off that easily. So far mine stays put, so it, that's really great. And um, yeah, so, so that side doesn't come off. It's only on that side, which is great. Cause you know, according to the series, that's where the weapon portion comes out. It's on that, on the right side. And you have, the extra claws, the longer claws, look at that, it's sharpened so well. So yeah, so just pull this portion out, see the peg right there? So it applies for both hands, and there you have it. Amazon's with the longer claws, so there you have it. So as compared, just a quick comparison, that is the, the difference in the sharp claws. So I'm glad they included that, and they also included the slash effect so just plug it back like that and there you go wolverine no 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 so so basically yeah some some if a very nice effect and it does a slash so it's like all the way down to ah! so uh, there's a lot of shouting in this video so anyways so yeah it's very nice so it's just a normal you know the the, the, the swift effect and if you plug it out this is what happens so you got to be careful so this is what happens when i try to take it off i did it so yeah, it might get stuck there, but it can be taken off. So don't worry. Don't worry. So these little knee guard pieces comes off fairly easy. So it's like in a small little pack. So just be careful with that. Sometimes it may come off and you won't even notice it until it's gone. So, you know, the toy collectors out there. So be careful with that. So without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy the stop motion articulation video of Amazon Omega. So in summary, so yeah, you know, so I just put it a little bit, you know, not all the way in, so be careful with that. Anyways, yeah, this figure is amazing. Yes, I, I really love it. There's so much this figure can do, you know, it has great articulation, he has great paint application and sculpt, and he has a ton of accessories. So overall, as a package, Amazoningly amazing. Yeah, yeah, no, all right, okay, fine. There'll be an SH figures or Amazon Alpha coming up soon. So once I receive that, I'll be reviewing that. I really like that design as opposed to this one. But you know, in terms of the figure itself, it's still a wonderful figure. So thank you very much, you guys, for watching. You know, um, I know it's the Thanksgiving is over. I just like to take this opportunity to uh, thank whoever's been watching, whoever's been liking, commenting, uh, giving me construction criticism. Thank you very much, and uh, that motivates me to keep on. Uh, doing doing these kind of videos for you guys so thank you again and stay tuned for the next video see you guys Ooh, another hero from japan can you speak english please don't kick me again i'm still traumatized by your mentor's kick man he kicked it right in He's still trying to grow back I'm a ah. easy there spiky no sudden move <laughs> Well, that certainly didn't go as expected. Down boy? I'm no, not the stop. base! I'm already stop. ugly! I'm not the base! Ah, oh, oh, this is savage! Hmm, this doesn't count as bestiality, does it? I'm a Hello again. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Click the button below. No, do not click the thumbs down. Thumbs up. Yep, that's the one. Leave a comment in the comment section below. But absolutely no bullying. Got it? Anyway, also don't forget to subscribe! How am I able to fire without pulling the trigger? Huh, that's weird. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for the next video. For those who kept on watching, lots of love and hearts for you. Click here to enjoy more videos.